Kentucky back in 1942 as Cassius Clay. Here is Muhammad Ali. No denying the hands. He says he's worked pretty hard on his takedown defense coming into the UFC. Well, he's going to have to. He's the greatest boxer of all time. But it won't be just boxing that will allow for him to find success inside the UFC. But if you know Cassius Clay, if you know Muhammad Ali, you know he's the most fearless competitor that you can find. He's a tremendous boxer. Now it's time to see what he can do inside the UFC's office. He's got a lot of size, he's got a lot of length. We really enjoyed the visual on the scale here on Friday. Muhammad Ali taking his greatness to the Octagon here tonight. We'll see how it goes. The greatest of all time, Muhammad Ali, has graced the Octagon. He is ready to fight. Tyson's in the game, ladies and gentlemen. Last boxing competition for him against Kevin McBride in 2005. He loves this mixed martial arts stuff. You know about his appetite for competition. This feel, this felt like an eventuality. Tyson on the biggest stage tonight. Yeah, it always felt like Mike Tyson would make his way here because he loves fighting so much and he loves mixed martial arts so much. But if you ever thought a guy could cross over from boxing with the athleticism, you thought it was Iron Mike Tyson. He was so fast, he was so gifted. He's an A-plus athlete, and if he commits himself to the wrestling like he did boxing, I imagine Tyson will find a lot of success inside the outcome. Once the baddest man on the planet, trying to realize that distinction again, albeit in a different combat sports setting. We'll see how it goes for Iron Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson, we are set for our main event of the evening. for this heavyweight fight. All right, now for the official introductions. We go to the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner, Iron Mike Tyson! Herb Dean, third Herb man Mike. in the octagon Ready. tonight. All right, this matchup of combat sports legends is underway. Muhammad Ali and Mike Tyson. And for Cassius Clay, of course, the thriller in Manila, the rumble in the jungle. Let us see what type of history he can make tonight against Iron Mike. I mean, so many believe that Mike Tyson could be the one that would cause Muhammad Ali issues. We finally get the question answered tonight as they get locked in the octagon. It's Tyson's ferocity, his speed against the craftiness of Muhammad Ali. Let's see who's going to be victorious. Just out of range with that left hook. Nice feedback right hand, my goodness. Great block there. Nice land with that punch, clearly taking advantage of his big edge and reach. Oh, how good is this? One minute into the fight, and we got a full on the These guys said that they were going to point to the center of the octagon, and they were going to fight. Did I believe them? No. So right now, I am so wrong. They are doing exactly what they said. Yeah, shades of Max Holloway against Ricardo Lamas back in the day. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, that one landed, yep. Trying to establish that jab once again. Tyson. 
Anderson. His nose is bleeding now, so we'll see how he handles that adversity, but nothing ideal about it here in the middle of this fight. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Oh, they're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Keeping busy now, connecting with those punches. from that cut with each strike landed and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy who's Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. We might get a stoppage here. Muhammad Ali's in half court. Print the shirts, ground and pound. Tyson's back in half guard. Reversal on the ground. Great job. Right inside his opponent's guard here, DC. You don't want to play around here too long. No, you got to either have two hands in or two hands out. You got to start doing that triangle. Under a minute to go. Clean punch. Oh, he's got the single collar locked in the clinch now. He's got to start throwing now. Muhammad Ali's cut on his nose is just pouring blood at this point. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Mm, that was nice. First round winding down here. Ali getting absolutely worked from the top here on the wrong end of nearly all of these ground and pound strikes. Oh. Round two is next. All right, there's the end of the round, and hopefully not the end of the fight. He doesn't look as handsome as he did when he walked out. That is a severe gash on his face. All right, so now we have some real adversity. There's a cut on the nose. Hard to know if that's impacting the breathing, but some definite damage in that previous round. Yeah, some real damage. And now when you get a cut like that, that is in a bad spot. Because every time you get hit on the nose, it's so jarring and then the blood starts to go down into the mouth. He's got an uphill battle ahead of him. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, second round on the right. The left punch is true, now the right hand. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's gotta go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it, going into fight. really bleeding heavily now. That cut is only getting worse by the Ooh! Oh! Huge left! So pretty good recovery by the opponent after getting stunned pretty good. Gotta capitalize on that. Oh! He's hurt bad. Well, no. oh, yes. 
elbow. Lands a nice punch from his back. Well, we told you off the top of the broadcast he could do it all, but he's leaning on the striking tonight and continues to hit his opponent, really, with most of what he's throwing. Well, he can't miss. I mean, it's like the guy's throwing a baseball at the side of a barn. Huh. He, everything he throws, he lands, and he's showing. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge slow in a big moment in this fight. Well, part of the ref is going to step in here, yes, and call on the doctor to look at that nose job. Might need one after this <laughs> fight. He might, because his face looks so different. He's unrecognizable from yesterday. The blood has really become a problem for him. I'm not even sure how the doctor's going to be able to find that cut under all the blood, but he did, and it looks as though, given the location, he's going to allow the fighter to continue, at least for now. You ready to fight? You ready? Right, so the ringside position has made his way back to his seat. The referee gets the action back underway. The fans are excited this fight's going to continue. Absolutely. And I'm just as excited myself. I want to see these guys compete. I want to see who wins. I don't want it to stop because of a cut. I want to see the best fighter get their hand raised at the end of the night. Luckily, we get to try to do that. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money. Oh, no. Just misses with the straight leg. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's going to have some work to do if we get to the stool between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only going to continue to get worse. Gets up. The question is for how long? So far, a frantic pace as expected. So Iron Mike Tyson's cut on his nose does not look good. Actually, it looks really bad. You got to think the ringside position is going to get called in here. Oh, he's on bottom right legs now. Right Trying to finish this fight. So a much oh, man, this is wild. These guys are both going. Oh, oh my goodness. What an absolute freak of a knockout here tonight. That's a three-check knockout, right? Show money, win money, bonus money. Absolutely, J.A. There's nothing more exciting than a knockout in sport. You don't see it anywhere but mixed martial arts. This young man will celebrate this deep into the night as he should. Here now, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 26 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Muhammad Ali! Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. I'm asking the producers, how soon can I get up? Because it's going to be a party over there. Not only because of the knockout, 